Good morning, Minecraft, and welcome to the world of Arch Spore. Today is going to be a very special episode because today I have finally reached 300 subscribers, which is completely amazing since it's only been a few months. I think I'm just barely getting started on my third month of posting videos, so. 300 subscribers in less than three months is really amazing. So I wanted to thank each and every, each and every one of my subscribers for, uh, and all my viewers for watching my channel. And I really hope you guys enjoy the buildings that I've been building. Um, so let's take a look around. Um, some of my other subscriber specials, uh, I think I did this one in the first week, or maybe it was the second week. It was for my 22 subscriber special. And I wanted to thank all of you guys, all of the old time. You've been here a long time. Um, and I know a lot of, a lot of you guys have been pretty pretty regular on my channel. I see your your comments a lot and I appreciate every one of them. Um, a few of you guys I haven't seen um, I'm guessing since uh, school started everybody's been busy. Um, I know myself I've been getting back to work a lot a lot more. So thanks to all my first 22 subscribers for sticking out sticking it out for such a long time um, and of course the lion is dedicated to you guys I wanted to talk a little bit more about uh, what's been going on around um, the world here um, this huge mountain is slowly becoming my mansion still have a lot of area to carve out in it um, this little hill over here was the original mine that I started and has my monster trap in it where I collect all my uh, um, drops, bone meals, TNT, stuff like that. Um, over here, this little shack is actually the entrance to my new mine, the big mine. <laughs> um, if you guys have watched uh, the Serious Mining show, um, my new newest mine is down here. Um, and I also wanted to explain that all of this around here was built using the 1.7 client and only a couple of things were built during a, uh, well built on a multiplayer server. So all of it is built using the survival mode from the 1.7. Um, creative mode didn't exist. So... Um, and I didn't I haven't used any mods or hacks or cheats of any kind to build any of this um, So the library was all uh, 1.7 I physically had to climb up Each and every layer and build build it one block at a time um, The same with the hotel over here. It's all built one at a time the only thing around here that is not uh, 1.7 uh, single player is this tower here. Bleed actually came onto my world in a 1.7 um, home hosted from my computer server. It's not a uh, professionally hosted server like the world is currently. Um, and he built the tower while we were waiting for the mushroom farm to <laughs> populate. So that was my first uh, collab or multiplayer video that I had ever made was with Bleed. Um, the lighthouse over there is also a 1.7 single player. This, however, is kind of a mix between multiplayer and single player. However, I did collect each and every block myself. 
Um, laying out the initial scaffolding, scaffolding took 10,000 blocks of dirt to lay it out. And yes, I have 10,000 blocks of dirt um, from mining, from landscaping, from building this thing, from digging out my mansion. I have boxes of dirt everywhere. Um, I have a ridiculous amount of cobblestone all over, so I'm surprised I haven't built a lot more cobblestone buildings because of having so much of it. I usually use it as like a filler material or actually no, I took a lot of cobblestone, I baked it down and I turned it all into uh, this clean stone to build this tower with. I believe that was three chests of clean stone that I made. But now after I think I started building this map in the first of July. The first week of July I know I started building this map so it's been almost four months. Oh and there's a couple of new things that I wanted to show off as well. Um, some things that I've been building since I've moved it to a professional hosted, professionally hosted server. So it's not just running off my home computer anymore. Um, here's a couple of buildings. Um, while Bleed and Uno and Mbot were visiting my server, when we first had it up and running, we did a lot of uh, stress testing on the server and we blew everything up with TNT. And over here we had a giant melon head created just for fun and we blew it up with TNT and this is a memorial to that to that melon head um, called the Greeny Meanie Melon and I built the tower out of um, hard earned sandstone and glass that I baked off and the seeds that I found from a abandoned mine shaft that's way off over that direction. And then Bleed came along and I said, hey, let's make it a farm. So we made it into a, uh, a melon farm. It's not automated in any, any way, but it does have a lot of melons in it. It goes all the way up to the top. And now let's go ahead and get on to the, the point of this particular episode, the 300 subscriber special. And I've got something over here at the end of my, what I'm calling the King's Highway. Um, more likely the Pharaoh's Highway, because when I was building it, I, I pictured there was an Egyptian Pharaoh living in my mansion and he was commanding his slaves to build this highway. <laughs> yeah, I, th I think a lot like that when I'm building. So, here is the spawn location that uh, Una Wild has gone and set up to make it a little more comfy and cozy. And there's some signs directing, giving directions to where to go. Got the library and the mansion is south of here and north of here is the river village and it's the underground city um, it doesn't really have an official name yet as soon as um, Piston Minecraft is done working on it we'll go ahead and show it off and here we are at the end of the highway and off to the left is the route to the river village that got created a week ago, two weeks ago, something like that. And some friends of mine and I got together and extended the highway out a little bit more and made a bridge over the lake. Oh, who's this? It looks like my old friend, Archie. Hey, Archie, how you doing? Where you been lately? been hiding or something we're just out playing around all right well let's go check out the bridge all 
it's all sandstone and gravel and it looks like the person that I was supposed to meet here in the middle of the bridge is invisible. Oh, hey guys, where'd you guys come from? Hello, Bleed, how you doing? Had a nice cookie? We got from... <laughs> want that cookie? Take it. <laughs> no, I don't want the cookie. Uh-oh, executioner with an axe. <laughs> Run away. Okay, okay, so I, I, oh. Sorry, this is not good either. <laughs> so, how it's doing, man? Good. 300, eh? Yep. Nice bridge. <laughs> thanks for, uh... Thanks for building it. Yeah. Well, it's no problem. I like building. As you know, I can't stop once I start. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have to say, bleed, okay? It's done. It's done. Stop. Okay, I'm going to kick you, and then I stop. Yeah, I like it. Love the lava, you know. <laughs> and I don't know how. Um, well, it, I didn't alone, by the way. And, hey, I helped. Uh, it, yeah, kind of. No, you, okay, yeah. You built one you side, and the... then I copied the other side. I, I, let me join you on the, uh, um, well, the arches were hard to make because of the limitation of sandstone. Right, no uh, sandstone stairs. What the, what's up with that? <laughs> yeah, by, by the way, Notch added uh, nether brick stairs. Why not nether um, sandstone stairs? I, I wonder, but anyways. Uh, yeah, I like it, and fits with uh, the the road. Really cool. And that's Uno running around playing on the 300. So this I'm gonna make this a short episode. So let's uh, let's say farewell and thanks to all my viewers. Uh, so have a good day. Bye, bleed. Bye, Uno. Bye, bye. Take care. Thanks, guys.